We got an update from George R. R. Martin, the man himself. <laughs> not a block, but it's not about the winds of winter. <laughs> Hello, friends, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Scott. If you're first time here or not subscribed, uh, please like, share, but definitely subscribe. It helps out the channel. About 30% of you aren't subscribed that watch these videos. I don't edit, so <laughs> let's see how this one goes. But anyways, George R. R. Martin, we all love him. God bless him. Live a very long life. Um, joined or joined, wrote on his not a blog that there was an update yesterday they wrapped house of the dragon house of the dragon. Okay, George, I am, I'm excited to see what happens with this. I'm going to hopefully do some live, um, live streams after the show premieres. Usually they're, they'll probably do it Sunday nights, like the old, um, game of Thrones, but, um, we'll, uh, I'm not so excited. I mean, I'm more excited to see the winds of winter, George. Why do you keep teasing me? So, as of February 17th, George wrote, Exciting news out of London. I am informed that shooting has wrapped for the first season of House of the Dragon. Yes, all 10 episodes. Well, at least it's 10 episodes and not the what we got season 8. Um, I have seen rough cuts of a few of them and I'm loving them. Of course, a lot more work's needed to be done. Special effects, color, timing, score, and all the post-production work. But the writing, the directing, the acting all look terrific. I hope you will like them as much as I do. My hat is off to Ryan and Miguel. Miguel Sapachik, I can never say his name, and Ryan Condal, Condal. Um, and to our amazing cast. And oh, I thought they said Omicron. Oh my God. Sorry. House of the Dragon 2022. Rain will fire. That's a pretty dope picture, though. That's a cool looking uh, dragon. You know, I don't think it's Balerion. The Black Dread, I think, was dead by then. Uh, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure Balerion was dead. But that is a cool poster. Um, Am I excited? No. Are you excited? Tell me. I really would like to know. Uh, comment in the comment section down below. Look. George has been writing Winds of Winter for 11 plus years now. Is it 11 plus? Holy cow. What didn't, yeah, Dance with Dragons came out in 2011. So almost 11 years or a little over or about 11 years, whatever it was. I, I am not a hater of George. You could ask anybody who's in my spectrum of fandom, but I am not also one of these fluff people that lets him off. Okay, it's been long enough, George. I have a feeling he got to a point where Dance with Dragons was finished, had a lot of leftovers, had a lot of leftover chapters. He's admitted to that, that he cut a bunch out of the book. Then we had all those sample chapters. How are you not done <laughs> years later, man? Like, did the show spoil it that much for you? I mean, we do remember... The last season, I think the final episode, he was tweeting a day or two after about the last kingdom instead of Game of Thrones. I think he was done with it after maybe season five, maybe six. He just it went a direction he was not happy with. Um, we could thank Dan and Dave for that. Gotta love them. But there are some people that are involved in House of the Dragon that love Game of Thrones and the Song of Ice and Fire world. Um, you know, Sapachek and Condell, Condell. I mean, they were both part of the probably better episodes of the last few seasons. Um, George has been intimate with this. I think he's been not, maybe he might be like, he might get some writing credits. I don't know how much writing he actually did. I mean, he's not doing the book, so he probably has a lot. Um, but there's also some great actors. Um, yes, the canon has been disrupted and people will be like, oh, it's, you know, you're just, you don't like diversity. No, I don't mind diversity. I don't care if you change a character from white to black, if it doesn't affect canon. And they already did that with the sea snake, but we'll get into that closer to this season. I've already gotten to that before. Don't call me a hater. I just love my canon. Sorry. So what do you guys think? Are you excited about House of the Dragon? 
Are you more excited that if we got news about the book, you tell me, I would love to um, hear it in the comics and I'll respond. Comics, comments, and I'll respond. But until then, live streams every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday night. Please subscribe, help out the channel. Have a great day, everybody.